taekwondo e caça. Virtual Blues is a song that wasn't supposed to be called Virtual Blues, but we haven't found a better name for it till this day, so we needed to release the record, and there it was, Virtual Blues. If you have a, a better name for it, please send us. I would like to know. But now it is all over, so it's just uh, to have fun. It's about people's uh, extreme addiction to social network. I'm, I'm starting to be a little scared and a little angry too about that um, way of living. People are too obsessed with Facebook, Twitter, Snapchat, all those Instagram and all those Google Plus, all those social networks. Although I think they are super great because they connect us all and, and you can communicate with a lot of people and they, they are super important in today's society. I use it a lot. The thing that scares me is that every day I watch people alienated from the real world living virtual lives on all those networks. And I think people are really missing out uh, what, what life means. You should be with other humans in real time, in the same place, talking to each other. I see a lot of people going to dining, uh, going to restaurants, and they are four guys, in a, four people in a table, all with the phones, dining together, but not together. They are, each one of them is in, is in a different dimension. One is on Facebook, the other one is on YouTube, and they all think they are with each other, but they are missing out life. I see people, a lot of people, going to shows and watching the shows like this. Come on, you have a band in front of you. Enjoy the band, enjoy that moment, keep it in your memory and change it because that's one of the beautiful things about memories. They aren't real, they are your perspective about reality. And that's the beautiful thing about it. And you can tell people the story of the show that you went and not, hey, look at the show. And to me, it's, it's saddening and it bothers me a lot. So the song is, is an, an irony take on, on that thing. In the middle eight, I say, here I am living my life through the lens of my iPhone. This will be my meal today in this fancy restaurant. I just wish you were here to make it even more fun. But sometimes the guy is there or the girl is there with you and you are, you are just trying to say to people that you are in that fancy restaurant or in that fancy place, forgetting that you are in that fancy place, not taking advantage of the moment. So it is a kind of a take on that. And to all those people that have thousands of friends on Facebook, but they don't actually have any friend on real life, or none of those friends are really their friends. People come to me sometimes and, and tell me, we are friends on Facebook. And I always say, if we were friends, should you be telling me that? If we were friends, I would know you. I don't know you, I just, but you're just on my Facebook. But that's how things are. So please live your life, live it, embrace the moment, be with your family and friends, buy our CDs. That's super important also to create a better world, is for you to buy Buddha Power Blues records. I can't imagine a better thing to do. So this is a good advice too. And the song, uh, goes uh, into a shuffle groove, a little different melody and harmony, but it is a blues. Then it has a middle eight that changes a little bit the melody, and it is uh, heavily inspired by Carlos Paredes, one of our greatest idols. And then it goes to an outro, which really embraces that feeling of Portuguese Carlos Paredes thing, which is a style on its own and it is very melodic, very landscapey, very soundtrack feeling. And it has a, a melody, it ends up with a melody that goes in to, to the next song, which is Super Glue, that also ends up with that melody. So we kind of glued two songs and the song that is glued to Virtual Blues is Super Glue. So that's probably why it's glued to Virtual Blues. Ha <laughs> ha!